Hi, and welcome to Bayberry Lane Art. Today, I'm doing Bible journaling. Here, I am using my finger to spread some basic blue onto the page. I haven't prepped the page, I just went straight to it. And here, I am now, once the blue is dry, I am adding um, a little white with glazing medium and putting on a thin layer. Usually you can put an old scrap piece of paper on, pull the paper off, and it will pull off the white leaving a distressed look. However, I forgot I left my fan on. So um, yeah, it didn't work so good. So I used a baby wipe and, and rubbed off some of the white and it worked fine. Now I'm taking a ruler here and I'm just gonna put in the lines, um, not even, but I want to give the illusion of panels of wood. So once I get that in there, I'm going to put in the circles to represent the screws that hold the wood in place. So I wind up using a stylus and dip it into paint, black paint, and dip it in onto where I want all the screws. And then I use white and highlight the black dots so it gives it a three-dimensional look. Here I'm using Faber-Castell color pencils and I'm highlighting the verses that I want to remember on these pages. So now here, um, I got some rub-ons. These are basic gray uh, rub-ons you have to experiment with until you find one that really works for you. I really like basic gray, it's nice and sturdy. So I cut out the pieces that I want. I remove the plastic protector and um, place it where I want it. And you just use a popsicle stick or uh, your bone folder or your, you know, anything that you can apply even pressure with and just keep rubbing it until you see the image start to transfer onto the paper. Um, you can cut up your images and splice them together also. At one point I need a, a longer piece so I splice two pieces together and you'd never know it. They're a lot of fun to use. You should try it. Okay, so I got a little of the transfer onto my page protector there, so just use a piece of scotch tape, put it on the transfer, and pull it right up, and the transfer comes off. Here I am using Signo white pen, and I'm filling in um, some of the petals, I'm highlighting the leaves, just to bring a little brightness into the piece.
And there you have it. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you give it a try. It was a lot of fun. Have a blessed day.